Hey, my name is Lenora. I am the content creator for My History Verified, located at TikTok, and you can find me on YouTube. Now, the purpose of creating the My History Verified page, I actually had came across TikTok when they first went beta, and I just did not like it. Um, I, I tried to figure out how to make my business work, which was my resume writing service. I found it very difficult to even try to create content for TikTok. Here I am, fast forward, creating content for my history or my lineage and the trail that it takes to get to each and every ancestor. Now, I never thought that it would flow like this when it came to creating the content for uh, this subject, which is ancestry and genealogy. Oh, wow, was I, uh, you know, wrong about that. Now, um... With my resume writing service, even though I wrote my own book, um, it's content, um, you know, created and had the design for the book covers, everything, the marketing, everything, and knew how I wanted to present anything online for that, uh, for the resume writing, and job interviewing, uh, work readiness, uh, how to deal with employers. I, I had all of that down pat. But when it came to my history verifying and presenting you all with some decent con, uh, content for it, oh goodness, I mean, I felt at home. Um, not only that, I am very proud to see how the, 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 I, we say the youngins are rocking out and kicking butt here on TikTok. They're not playing. You really are playing. And I am so proud of you. I'm very, very proud of you. Now, each and every one of us have our purpose here at TikTok when it comes to uh, whatever industry we are presenting, what information we are presenting to our viewers and listeners. But within the Aboriginal or Mary Indian uh, community, each person definitely, it, well, it appears that each person definitely has their purpose. My purpose is to present my ancestors genealogy and how do I do that I'll let you know how um, well let me start over Uh, who my ancestors are on both the uh, paternal and maternal side and then there is what tools and resources I use to find that information Uh, thirdly uh, have some fun while doing it for uh, lives and being able to present some quality lives for you. Um, fifth, I, I overall just being able to absorb as much information um, as I can. Not only that, you know. Um, I come uh, believing and thinking and feeling and, um, you know, that I am great at what I do, especially when it comes to locating my ancestors. Now, with that, with that said, I actually have the ability and the guts to open up my assistance or open up you know uh my space 
uh, within my platform and also with assistance with helping other people with their ancestry and genealogy, um, uh, their dives and their, their journey and taking that path to find out who's on their branch. I mean, you know, who's within their branches of their trees. Uh, it's not an uh, easy task at all. You know, sometimes um, it's, it's never boring for me. So I might add that. I don't know what it is with someone else, but it's definitely not boring for me or to me. I, I mean, I absolutely adore it. I actually sleep with one finger scrolling on the phone or the other hand tap it on a computer with one eye open, one eye shut. Um, some of my days go like that and my nights as well. Uh, what's interesting about being here at TikTok with this ancestry and genealogy uh, journey is that I'm with like kind. That means more quote unquote descendants of Aboriginal Amerindians. All right. Uh, on Facebook, uh, I think like four or five years ago, I was in um, ancestry genealogy uh, groups. And then you have know it alls that actually marginalize their, their group members. That means only the administrators know or have the expertise that everybody else is just flock. No matter what you know, no matter what information you are providing. Um, I've also had experts knock me down or beat me down when I told them about um, the Mary Indian side or DNA that I had. And so one of the experts uh, said that she was a Mary Indian and because I know that, you know, I guess profile pic, and a lot of people go back profile pic, they see a black person or a uh, person of color, they then deem that person uh, impossible to be an Aboriginal. Now, this, or I'm, I'm speaking about a, a person who is supposedly, as she states, or has stated that she was a scientist who specialized in DNA. And I was in a group with a, um, I can't remember his name. He's actually written a book uh, and more about the subject of DNA uh, testing and results. So it was ironic that this person uh, tried to convince me that you know, that it was impossible for me to have Aboriginal Indian blood. Now, with those different tests, for instance, Ancestry.com, my history, uh, I'm sorry, my uh, heritage, you have family DNA, you have... Um, um, many, many other ones. What is it? Family DNA. You have Gen Match. Gen Match does not um, is it's not a company where you give a sample, uh, but you do upload after you take your sample. You get your results for the companies that is doing the testing of that DNA uh, sample. Gen um, Match is a very, very high tech company where uh, once you've had your results. You are able to upload your raw DNA DNA data to its database, and then um, it actually deep deep dives. There are many many tests at GenMatch, and those tests um, have given me the ability to definitely uh, determine a lot about my Indian Aboriginal blood. So um, another website or a DNA data database is uh, that I use is trueancestry.com. Now, if I don't get a chance to mention all of the different resources and tools that I uh, utilize, 
please, please do not um, pigeonhole it, pigeonhole me in a box because this is the very first podcast that I'll be doing for My History Verify, but there are many more to come. So do take this as episode one and look forward to episode two of my podcast on next Monday. Um, now to continue, uh, speaking of Jim Match, Jim Match actually gives me nearly over four to five percent of Aboriginal blood. That includes the Mexican blood and and or DNA. Um, 